Okay, this, this drill is, uh, uh, we just call it back foot off the ground, all right, at soft toss. And what we're trying to do is, again, staying away from squishing the bug. Okay, we want to make sure that we get up off that back foot. So uh, Nick's going to show you what it looks like to squish the bug. And I want you to just pay attention to the front shoulder when he, when he squishes the bug here. Okay, the front shoulder kind of flies out a little bit when all the weight's back on the foot. Now, we're going to do the uh, back foot off the ground here. And again, he's going to over-exaggerate it. But um, uh, as he does that, his back foot will come off the ground. You'll see his front, his, his chin and his front shoulder kind of go uh, with the ball a little bit towards the pitcher. Now, we don't want to do it too much, but it's just a gradual thing to get off the backside. So here we go. Okay. Raise that up just a little bit more. I really feel that being up on the back toe or even off the ground is going to free up your hips. It's going to keep the shoulders in. And what it will do is keep the bat in the zone much longer. And I think that's important for young kids. You see all the big leaguers, they are always coming up off the back foot at contact. And that just allows them to hit the ball farther. And I think that's what we're all looking for is to be able to drive the baseball. So a couple more here, guys. Back foot off the ground. Good. Good. His hips do come forward just a little bit, but I, I think that's, that's better than squishing the bug and keeping all the weight on the back foot.